And hi everyone, welcome back to another video from Wondershirt Dr. Phone, solving a mystery about your iPhone. So has your iPhone ever decided to change its passcode without your consent? It can happen, and it's not a commonly reported issue, but it certainly is possible, leaving you locked out of your device. That's why this video is here to guide you through some of the authentic methods to resolve this puzzling problem. Before that, give a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel to get more of these useful videos. Now let's go ahead and dive right in. Part 1. What are the reasons for iPhone passcode changing by itself? It's important to learn about the possible reasons for this frustrating issue before we go for the solutions. So there are several reasons why an iPhone or an iPad for that matter might change its own passcode without user intervention. Firstly, frequent iOS updates can sometimes introduce glitches that lead to automatic changes in passcodes. These updates, while intended to enhance performance and security, can occasionally disrupt device functionality. Moreover, installing and using beta versions of iOS known for their instability and bugs can also contribute to the password changing issue. Users who opt for these early releases may encounter unexpected errors including password alterations and also the presence of malware poses a significant threat, as malicious apps can compromise system security and lead to unauthorized changes in passcodes. Part 2. The simple solution, remove iPhone passcodes with Wondershare Dr. Phone. To be honest, resolving this problem can be pretty challenging, especially for complicated scenarios. But don't worry, Wondershare Dr. Phone offers a straightforward solution without requiring significant effort. It simplifies the process of removing the iPhone screen lock, assisting in various scenarios, including Touch ID, Face ID, and other common screen lock methods. So users can regain access to their devices within minutes through the wonderful and successful abilities of Dr. Phone. All in all, whether facing password alterations or other lock-related issues, this tool offers a reliable and efficient solution to restore access to iPhones and iPads. Follow these clear step-by-step -step instructions to complete the screen unlocking process without unnecessary delay. First, install Monitor Doctor Phone on your PC and launch its application. Then go to the Toolbox section from this app interface and select the Screen Unlock feature. After that, select iOS and then go for the Unlock iOS Screen feature. Once selected, press the start button to proceed with the procedure. Next, walk through with the on-screen instructions and set your iPhone into recovery mode. Once your iDevice model gets recognized, select the system version and click the start button to initiate. Now when the iOS firmware gets downloaded for your iPhone, hit the unlock now button. Afterwards, input the confirmation code in the following window and then select unlock. Finally, a progress bar runs for the iDevice unlocking process, which takes you to another window after completion. After that, just hit the done button and start using your unlocked iPhone from there. Part 3. Set up the device again using the security lockout procedure. When you enter an incorrect passcode 10 times, your iPhone enters security lockout or iPhone unavailable mode, requiring you to erase all data to regain access. Unfortunately, there is no direct method to regain access when the passcode changes, requiring a factory reset to restore usability. For a detailed walkthrough on how to navigate the situation, refer to the guide provided next. So once you are in the iPhone unavailable stage, select the forgot password option shown in the bottom right. Now hit the start iPhone reset button to initiate the resetting process. You will be then prompted to enter your Apple ID to sign out of it in the next window. After that, you will be then provided an option to either keep eSIM and erase data or delete eSIM and erase data if your iPhone has a running eSIM. Fortunately, Apple has another favor in this regard. You can temporarily sign into your iPhone through your old passcode within 72 hours if you have recently changed the passcode. Once signed in, you will have to set a new passcode immediately to regain normal functions. Part 4. Using iTunes to set up iOS device again. If your iPhone's passcode changes unexpectedly, iTunes offers a reliable solution to reset the iDevice to factory settings and unlock the screen lock. While effective and secure, this method does result in the loss of device data. If you're willing to compromise on data loss, follow these instructions to resolve the iPhone passcode change itself issue using iTunes. First of all, install iTunes on your computer and run it. Then connect your iPhone and put it into the recovery mode. To do this, apply the following steps for the relevant iPhone models. For iPhone 6S or earlier, press and hold the power button and the home button. Wait for a few seconds and the recovery mode screen will appear. For iPhone 7 or 7 Plus, press and hold the power and the volume down buttons. 
until the screen for the recovery mode comes. For iPhone 8 or later, press and instantly release the volume up button and then the volume down button. And then press and keep holding the power button, then you will be redirected to the recovery mode screen in just a while. Now iTunes will automatically detect your device in the recovery mode and give you two choices where you can either update or restore it. Simply select the restore option and click the OK button to remove the passcode from your iPhone successfully. Part 5. Using iCloud to set up iOS device again. Another secure and advisable approach is to use iCloud to set up and unlock your device. However, you will still have to face data loss on your device. So to use this method, make sure that the Find My service is active on the device and that you remember your Apple ID and password. Follow this detailed guide to reconfigure your iOS device using iCloud. So begin by opening the web version of iCloud on your computer computer's web browser and then input your Apple ID and password to sign in to your account. After that, go for the grid option to locate and select the Find My option from the list. Once selected, choose your locked iPhone and simply select the Erase This Device option to remove all of your phone data. Your device will then be reconfigured and you will have complete access to it. Part 6. Using Find My app to set up iOS device again. You can also set up your iPhone using the Find My app with some conditions fulfilled. For instance, you'll require another iOS device to log into the same Apple ID with the Find My feature activated. When all of it is ready, you can proceed with the following instructions to configure the effective device. So start by launching the Find My app on another iOS device and access the Devices tab. Then locate your locked iPhone among the list and select it. Now choose the Erase This Device option to remove the screen lock from your iPhone. By doing this, your phone will be immediately turned into a new device through a factory reset. And with this, we have mentioned almost all of the applicable solutions to resolve this issue and are going to end the video right there. So you can try any of the discussed methods to get rid of your locked iPhone situation within a few minutes. However, if you're looking for the perfect solution without worrying about other complexities, Wondershare Doctor Phone is a clear choice for you. Moreover, don't forget to give a thumbs up to this video if you liked this informative video and share your problems with us in the comment section as well so that we can help you out. Subscribe to our channel for more content just like this. And until next time, have a good one.